Hello, good morning. Magpagpalang umaga po sa inyong lahat. Good morning, America. Magandang umaga, Pilipinas. To all my viewers, mga kalola at kalolos, to all mothers around the world, and to all families who are watching, I just want to share with you about this beautiful uh, chair and a beautiful table and more. I did not even look the other one, but it's true here in America, especially if it's garbage day, uh, as I walk in the street going home, I saw this beautiful office chair to buy furniture because every week you can find furniture in the street all kinds of beautiful stuffs that you can use so guys I'm just sharing with you this so you will see that America is the land of plenty so let's be joyful always Let's pray continually. The way to rejoice at all times is to find moment by moment pleasure in our relationship with God, the lover of our soul. Our relationship is so full of comfort and encouragement that it's possible to be joyful in hope even when we are in the midst of adversity. Let's give thanks in all circumstances like this this is a beautiful gift to those who need it there is immense power in praying thank you lord these three words are appropriate for all times and in every situation because of god's great sacrifice for us i encourage you all to praise god for every good things as soon as we become aware of it. This practice adds a sparkle to our blessings, heightening our joy. Guys, when we're feeling sad or discouraged, it is still a good time to thank God. This demonstrates our trust in Him and brightens our perspective to enhance our gratefulness Let's ponder specific things about God that delights us. God's continual presence, His lavish grace, His unfailing love. Thank Him in all circumstances, strengthens our relationship with Him, and helps us live more joyfully. So these things give me joy, even, even if it's small or big. I thank God for the blessings. If you like this video, please subscribe. And I thank you so much for watching. Till next, God bless us all. Thank you.